G'day and welcome to the daily results update for Friday the 4th of December. Coming into the happy season, Christmas time, but let's kick off today in Bendigo at the Pro Tour event where number one seed Olivia Rogowska has been knocked out in the second round. Rogowska went down against Rochelle Hugenkamp of the Netherlands in a tough three set match, 6-4 in the final set. Isabella Holland had a good win over Japan's Ayumi Oka, 6-3, 7-5. And Arina Rodionova had also had a great win against Japanese Shiko Akita, 6-3 in the final set. On the men's side, Matthew Ebden continues his winning ways with a straight sets win over Dane Kelly, while Leon Frost had a big upset over number three seed Daniel King-Turner. James Lemke was in devastating touch against Robert Phillips, winning in straight sets, 6-1, 6-1. South Australian Queensland are celebrating after capturing the Optus 14 Under Team Championships. South Australia beat ACT to claim the boys title for the third consecutive year. In the girls final, Queensland won both singles rubbers to seal victory over South Australia. The Optus 14's Australian Singles Championships will get underway tomorrow at Melbourne Park. Now to the quarterfinal matchups in Bendigo and Alicia Mollick will be taking on young gun Monica Vainert. And Isabella Holland, fellow Queenslander, will be up against France's Irina Pavlovic. In a battle of the big serving men, Gregory Jones from New South Wales will be taking on Caden Hensel. While Colin Everthite and Bryden Klein will be having a rematch of their tight tussle last week. Finally, in international news, Amelie Moresmo has announced her retirement from professional tennis. Amelie won the 2006 Wimbledon and Australian Open title. And she says she's had enough. I've had enough too, so I'm out of here. See you here Monday at tennis.com.au.